Hi, I'm Paula Renova, and today we're going to talk about the power of forgiveness, which is a force within our hearts that can really change our lives. But before we start diving in, don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you haven't already, to hit the notification button, that little bell that tells you when we have new content for you, to comment your experience in this video, how you felt about it, to like the video and to also share it with people that you know are gonna benefit from this content. So when you think about forgiveness, the power of forgiveness, the first thing I wanna mention is that it is one of the most healing energies that we have, especially regarding the physical body, the health of the body and your finances. Because when we hold on to resentment and we hold on to grudges, we can make the cells of our bodies sick and we can also create financial imbalance right our financial life may need help because when we hold on to resentment and to grudges we are occupying space in our energy fields in our hearts in our bodies in our souls that could be for the flow of abundance for the flow of wealth and for the flow of life, which brings health to your physical body. So resentment and grudges create blockages within, and they do not allow the health of the body to flow properly and the health of your finances to flow properly. So this is very practical. And we may not realize that we're holding on to resentment and to grudges. This can be deep-seated. It can be very unconscious. It could even be ancestral or from past lives, each person has a different story. But as human beings, we have choice, right? And you can choose to vibrate in the energy of forgiveness. Why am I not saying I choose to forgive someone or I choose to ask for forgiveness? Because the Cardinal Method of Life Connection, which is the system I developed to bring soul healing and consciousness expansion and the joy of life to the world, it's inspired in different systems. One of them is called Family Constellations and it was created by this very wise man called Bert Hallinger. And he used to say that when you say, I forgive you, you're putting yourself in a position of superiority as if you have power over someone. And when you say, please forgive me to another human being, not to God, not to life, we're talking about human relationships here. When you say, please forgive me to someone, you're putting yourself in a position of inferiority. So what I'm saying here is that when you choose to vibrate in the energy of forgiveness, you're cleansing yourself, you're making a choice to release resentment and to release grudges. So this is extremely powerful. And energetically, on a vibrational level, your unconscious mind understands this better. You're not feeling superior or inferior to anyone else. Another thing about forgiveness that's really important to understand is that we often do not forgive and we choose resentment and grudges as a defense mechanism, as protection. Our hearts have been hurt and wounded. So what the unconscious mind thinks is if I forgive, if I choose forgiveness with whoever hurt me, I am going to be vulnerable again to that person's actions, to that person's cruelty, whatever it is, right? So often the unconscious mind thinks that grudges and resentment are defense mechanisms, that they're protecting me, that they're good, but they're not because they are not aligned with our biology, not aligned with abundance. And there is an, an alternative to that. How can you protect yourself from people who have hurt you? and not hold grudges and not hold resentment. You can choose discernment. So what you can start to, to realize is that it's not because I have chosen forgiveness regarding this situation or this human being that I will be vulnerable again. I will not become blind to what happened. I will not ignore the truth. The cardinal method is always about the truth, right? The truth is what it is. You're not gonna change the story. You're not gonna change your perception of the person, but you are choosing to change your feelings. 
So if you just say, I have discernment when it comes to this human being, and I choose to lift the weight off of my heart with the energy of forgiveness so that my heart chakra opens, so that my cells, my biology is healthier, and so that I can create space for abundance to flow through me. So where the blockages of resentment were, were you know, blocking your energy, they will be dissolved and then the flow of abundance can reach you much more efficiently. So this is powerful and very important. The Cardinal Method is very much about chakras, right? If you don't know what chakras are, we have a video about it right here in this channel. You can watch it. But the heart chakra is a place of love and forgiveness is part of love, right? So the Cardinal Method is also about crystals and one of the crystals that is the most powerful crystals for energy healing in general for healing energy and especially for healing the heart is the master crystal of forgiveness in the carnal method, which is green tourmaline. So the green is here. This is a, a quartz matrix, but the green is right here. This is green tourmaline. If you want to see what it looks like on its own, this is a little strand of, of green tourmaline. So when you place green tourmaline on your heart, you are choosing the energy of forgiveness. You're choosing to vibrate in forgiveness with a person, with a situation, with a country, with a city, with a place, with whatever it is. And this is also important to know. Forgiveness comes in layers. It's not likely that you will suddenly, like a magic wand, choose forgiveness and then everything will be zeroed out. Everything will be fine. It takes dedication, it takes time. There's another pillar in the Cardinal Method, indigenous wisdom, shamanic wisdom. And this um, pillar of, of knowledge says that the soul needs time. The soul needs time to heal. But when you commit to forgiveness, you can be diligent layer by layer. It starts to dissolve the blockages of grudges and resentment and then you will feel peace in your heart. You will have the discernment about whoever has hurt you. You will know how to keep a safe distance if that's necessary, but you will not be holding the weight of grudges and resentment anymore. So forgiveness is powerful for many areas of your life, for your health, for your wealth, for the quality of your emotions, for the quality of your relationships. It just really feels much lighter and much more joyful when you choose forgiveness. So I hope this was useful for you. Don't forget to comment how you felt about this video and to like it, of course, and share it with people that you know are going to benefit from it. And please don't forget that every step we take in the direction of soul healing and consciousness expansion is going to increase the joy of your life. So thank you so much for being here. I am truly honored and truly grateful, and I will see you soon.